In this video, we're going to look at the variable pricing system in Easy Digital Downloads. Variable prices allow you to define multiple prices that the customer can then choose from when they're purchasing a product from your website. With the variable prices, we can define as many price options as we want, and we can also define the file downloads that are available for each purchase option. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. Inside of the download configuration box, there's a section that says price options, and there's a checkbox that says enable variable pricing. So when we check the enable variable pricing option, you'll see that a new section will appear with all of our price options. And so currently we have two price options, price one and price two, and we can see the price that we have set for each of these. We can also add a new price. So let's say price three, and we'll set it to price to $20. Let's go ahead and save our changes. Now we have our prices in here. And now notice that over here in the file download section, there is a, section, a, a column for price assignment. So we can choose which price is required to be purchased in order for this file to be downloaded. The default option is all prices, but let's say that we want this file only available to somebody who purchases the top tiered price. So we can simply say price three. And now we can update. And now only the customers that purchase price option number three will be able to access the PSD file. We can add another file if we want. Let's Maybe we'll just call it extras. And then we'll have our file URL right here that we'll, we will have uploaded. And now we can set this to say price two or all prices or price one. So we can choose the exact price that is required for each individual item. So that's very cool. Let's go ahead and take a look and see what this looks like on the front end. If we click view download, here's our, our product. And we see that now they have a menu, a list of radio buttons to choose from for each individual price. Price one, price two, price three. And you'll note that it shows the price for each one as well. And we can simply select the price that we want to purchase, click purchase, go to checkout. And you can see it says my WordPress plugin, price three for $20. And if I go ahead and complete this purchase, go through checkout. And now if I go into the payment history, you'll see that that price is shown there as well. We see the total amount is $20. View order details, we see that they purchased price number three. And now if we go into our purchase history, we can see that we have plugin files and PSD, but I don't have the extras because I didn't ever purchase price option number two. Now, if we look down one, we'll see that on December 1st, I did purchase price option number two, so I have the extras file as well. So that's the variable price system for easy digital downloads.